Okay, so I just woke up not too long ago. I've already brushed my teeth, washed my face. This is my first day of my fast. I am waiting for my tripod to um, update, I guess, on my phone because I haven't used it in so long. But I really want to start back YouTubing and stuff. So we're going to see where this leads me. Um, I haven't prayed and talked to God yet or anything. I think I'm running a little bit behind, but I have to do overtime at work today. And <clears throat> all my jobs have kind of been kicking my butt recently. Um, just because I'm tired. <laughs> so we're going to see. I have to work 7 to 7 today. And then I have to work tomorrow, which is Saturday. Um, two of my jobs. So, yeah. Let's get this morning going. some change so shout out to my man and fast is going okay I realize it's not that i really want to eat it's that i like the motion of eating i like to eat when i don't have anything else if that makes sense like when i'm bored when i'm sad when i'm upset i eat i like to eat i'm an eater it shows um lotion my body put on some clothes i think i'm going to do a braided ponytail because that's going to be like the easiest thing for me to do right now because i need to wash my hair but i don't want to wash it today and go outside you really get sick is that like an urban myth that like black people can't with like do, you, do people really get sick if they wash their hair and stuff and go outside Shoes, but I need to wash the bottoms of them really quickly. What do you want? Let's let her outside really quickly. So this is the sweater I'm probably gonna wear, but I cannot find my other. I can't find my other army pants, and I don't feel like they're in a dirty clothes because I just did laundry. Okay, we're gonna see if I like the fit of these, which I'm sure I'm probably not. We're gonna see how this goes. And I put on lotion, my girls. Y'all, y'all know. When you try and put on something tight and you just put on some lotion, man, who now, child? Let's see. Yeah, these are kind of tight. Oh, but I think we'll be okay. I'm just gonna button those ones. Oh yeah, I think we'll be fine. Hmm. Okay, so let me put this. 
It's actually a skin. This brand new. Don't worry. I didn't buy it. I don't be buying that expensive stuff. Okay, so then two on now, and that's just so that like when it falls off the shoulder, I don't have anything because like I could. I didn't want to put on a bra and you see it, so you're not gonna really even see the bandu really. Or maybe you will. I don't like this. This was the plan outfit, and I don't think I like it. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna button one of them, I think. Um, I don't hate it, but this is what we're working with, so. I think I'm gonna do gold jewelry. Well, gold and silver, because I normally mix anyways, so we're gonna do. These or these? I actually kind of like these instead. I haven't worn them in a minute either. We're just gonna do my Apple Watch with my links. I forgot what these links is called and where they from. Well, I got it from Amazon, but I forgot like who's the maker of them, but I love them. I think they turn in color a little bit though. And I think they're supposed to be like sterling silver or plated or something. I don't know. And I don't wear my watch. Like I'll do waves of wearing my watch. So it ain't cause of me. Um, I'm just gonna put on rings that I already have here. Something about that I don't like. I think I just want a plain gold ring. We're gonna do my fave. Let's go see the outfit. And um, I see if we like it. I'm not mad at it. Are we mad at it? I'm not mad Eddie, but these pants is in my crotch. It's something about it I don't like, but I'm right on time, so I don't have time. They were literally hanging out right by these. How are my black peacoats? Let's listen to Rowan. Really. Closing some lines. Let's roll. So it was my, I just finished my last day at the restaurant. I shipped and it was not the best to say the least. So I had a party of like 18 and um, I literally wrote it down because I was like, mm, you know, I probably do need to start journaling a little bit more. <laughs> and so I went in at 18 taught. It was pretty stressful. Like I was like shaking because I was like pretty stressed and it was pretty sucky. But I was like, you know, at least I get a nice tip because they look like people who tipped pretty nicely. And um I was like really frustrated, like about to cry type. And then there was this other girl who became a server. She normally complains like every day. And I guess she ended up like crying today and she had a table tip her like one table. One. Tip her like $120. And I don't know. I'm just trying not to get like upset because like at the end of the day, like I want to be happy for other people and I guess their blessings and stuff especially because like whether I do know a little bit of her story or I don't know their story at all like just because they get something doesn't mean they don't deserve it so it's not even the fact of like when people get things it's just like damn like I wanted to come in here and <laughs> make pretty decent money at least for my last night especially since I had like a huge party or whatever but I don't know I don't know if that's um and I put in here, I don't know if that's God, like, allowing Satan 
for me to see like someone else get blessed and then to see how I'm gonna feel about it like I don't know if that's just another test or um God just want to see if I'm gonna still trust him or I don't know but I'm just like I'm trying so hard and it's like you know like it has to get better but you just don't really know how so you're just like I don't really know if it is gonna get better because how is anything gonna get better like I don't know so yeah that's my last day serving at work oh and I forgot to mention my Christian girl night was amazing last night it was a great experience I wish I would have filmed more but there were some girls there I didn't know so I didn't want to like be that person that's like filming people you don't really know and stuff so that's that and then um my second day on my fast has actually been okay um but yeah even with tonight it just made me like Ugh, i want to eat something like if i could have had a french fry maybe it would have made my night a little bit better <laughs> it is i think i normally film on this side right yeah today friday saturday sunday monday for my fast we're doing good i'm implementing some more vegetables so i did go to chipotle today cleaning since yesterday my house um, today's been a great day at work because, um, I've gotten to rest a lot, which hasn't happened recently. Where's my tripod? Oh, it does need to actually charge. Um, this weekend was tough. I had an emotionally draining weekend, but God is still good. Um, I have a client that's about to come in a little bit, about to clock out of work. Nothing, like, too major going on. Um, I'm trying to figure out where I'm going to take my boyfriend for our, I was going to say honeymoon. It's not a honeymoon. Um, our Valentine's Day celebration, since I think I disclosed this information already, but it's my year to plan our Valentine's Day. So, because I didn't make the money that I wanted to make um, at the restaurant, I am trying to see um, a new location that we can eat at because the place that I wanted to eat at was, excuse me, going to be way too expensive. It was a la carte. I think that's how you say it or whatever. It was just out of budget. So we'll just do that another time. And um, honestly, I just want a really good place that has really good food. My man loves a nice meal. So, and I don't want to cook. I really want to take him somewhere. Am I being selfish because I want to get cute as well? Well, also, I think I'm going to cook on Sunday for us and our family. And then, um, also, we have something to do after we go eat. So, I want to make sure we're already out and about and not just, like, chilling at my crib. All right, so I did not do any of the things that I was supposed to do yesterday when it comes to, um... Oh my god, my ears ringing. When it comes to cleaning up and cleaning out my closet. So we're going to finish mopping the house, cleaning up. And then I'm still currently working so I can't clean out my closet. It's not going to happen. I just kind of don't feel like doing that right now. But I'm going to finish cleaning up. Maybe give me some lunch. And yeah, let's get this thing rolling. I feel like there was something else I was going to say. I don't know, but I was really tired last night. I'm kind of getting tired right now. But we're going to push through. It's 1 o'clock. I got a lot of work done, and I'm proud of myself. So, let's do what I want to do. Okay. Right there.
record anything because I had to update my phone so that I could get my iCloud back right and start editing videos. But I'm so happy I finally got it done and we're we're editing. Um, yeah, I'm super, super happy. And I'm just like, oh my God. But I just was doing like some research and it's basically saying like with YouTube, you need to have some type of storyline. I don't really know how true that is because I'm just doing my life and I feel like there's a story all the time, but then also my life is kind of boring. So I don't really know what I should really be saying or talking about, but I guess once I get in a group of things, I'll find my way and then you guys will find me. So we're going to see how that goes. In the meantime, um, shit, what was I about to say? Oh, I finally did my gel for my business. Then maybe that's going to be my story It's becoming full-time nail tech hopefully maybe by the end of the year i don't know there's so many things that i want to accomplish this year i feel like especially because i am turning 30 um and i'm not gonna lie at the beginning of the year i sort of was like you know what i don't know if that's even gonna happen because i don't see how that's gonna happen so i'm gonna change my plan and i was like oh, 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 oh. hold on girl um we're not about to do that because just because you don't see how it's going to happen, I'm not going to limit my God. No, nope. <laughs> we're not going to do that. So um, I guess like right now, my storyline is becoming a full time nail tech, um, getting the things I want for my birthday. And that is I really want to go on a trip to Barbados with my friends. I want to be able to pay for our Airbnb or at least half of it so that they don't have to. So basically, I want financial freedom. Um, I really want to get a new, well, yeah, I'm a, let me not say well, I really want to get a new car or lease a new car and pay mine off and keep it. Um, oh, and I wanted a birthday party to where all my family and friends could come, um, that obviously aren't, or, and are, aren't going to be able to go on the trip and stuff. So those are things that I want this year, most definitely. Um, one of those things was actually find losing weight and I'm 10 pounds away from my goal weight mm, 10 maybe 13 because I really could be 145 but 148 we shooting for you um yeah so I'm just super excited about that I think I have we jump in my brain is everywhere right now so we're gonna jump ship into right now today so those are kind of my goals for the week and I'm gonna make sure we remember or goals for the year I'm going to make sure I remember these and try and I hope I'm in frame this whole video. Y'all, that angle was so ugly. So ugly. I don't even remember what I was talking about because I had to get my tripod. But yeah, so those are my goals for the year. And I feel like I'm leaning a little bit. Am I leaning? I don't know. But um, yeah, so those are my goals for the year. Um, year. Um just when it comes to just trying to get what i want out of life um i do want to be become more giving there's other things that i want too that falls in line with getting those things so hopefully i can accomplish those things you know with god's mercy and grace and all that good stuff it's gonna happen and that's on period um but yeah so i was able to get my gel x done i'm super super excited to be able to offer this for my business i don't know if this can you see it really good i can't see because i film everything with my phone and i wish i had a i could see what i'm seeing basically i wish i could see what i'm seeing but um with that being said i'm just elated to offer this service i feel like it's gonna open so many more doors for me um so i'm gonna it's my first set so i'm just trying to ch make sure the durability is good and it's the longevity of the nails are good and the quality of the nails are good before i start offering the services but i will be offering the services soon uh, what else has been accomplished today work let's work <laughs> um i have a client in a little bit and i'm editing videos Oh, and today I was kind of able to finalize Valentine's celebration for this weekend. So uh, me and my boyfriend, we alternate every year who's over Valentine's Day. I'm over it this year, so I'm just trying to make sure I provide a nice experience, but still on the budget. <laughs> um, so I'm just getting those things finalized for this weekend. Um, I couldn't 
couldn't celebrate. The only time this year is on a Wednesday. So we couldn't celebrate the weekend before or the weekend after because I had to work and I actually have to work this weekend too, but I'm just gonna love my computer around with me. Um, and I get off at five and our reservation's at five. So I think we'll be okay. Um, other than that, I may work seven to four. I wonder if I can. You know what? I'm not doing that actually. I think they're back. I'm not doing that. Um, but what else? I think that's it. I'm excited to go on this journey with y'all though. I really am. All right, bye. My toasty, they came out amazing. Oh snap. I tell my boyfriend they're basically like toe sucking good look at that beautiful beautiful <laughs> good morning y'all it's 7 about 7 40 it's 7 50 i know it's not that much of a difference but i thought i was getting my life together but 7 50 ready to clock in to work and everything oh my god my man's calling Hey, handsome. Oh, nice to call and hang up on a nigga. Yeah, getting ready for the day. Let's do it. today see if it works see if I like it um and all that good stuff so I have to clean really really quickly sanitize everything do all that good stuff before my client gets here and I have to clock in to work at eight so 
It's a lot going on today, but let's get it done. <laughs> I'm so excited today. <laughs> just, I'm happy to have a day where I can just have some fun, go out, do some eat. Anyways, let's get through it. I've had my coffee. Well, when I got my coffee. Me and Boo Thang changed gifts last night. My gift came in that box. That's why I'm pointing over there. Um, about to finish doing some work. Obviously, getting some face care done. And then about to start getting ready. But, I don't know. My phone just died out of nowhere. So, I have to charge that. So, I can't really move around. So, I'm going to charge my phone. By the time I get a little work done, we're going to chill for a little bit. And then I'm going to start getting ready. So, <laughs>
to the restaurant we went to elephant east in downtown dallas it was so beautiful i love the atmosphere the food was great we got an appetizer with bang bang shrimp and then we got i believe it was the wagyu noodles and um what was the other thing called it was some type of like honey chicken all their food is pretty shareable and it was amazing like i'm not gonna lie to you even the ambiance was so beautiful I really love the restaurant we will be back and I was really happy I chose this restaurant because my boyfriend actually told me it was something on his list that he wanted to try but literally y'all why while we were sitting there eating our food we were like well what are we doing after this I told him we already had um or already had plans to go to a perfume making place or a cologne making place and he was like oh the Erica Badu concerts tonight and I was like so do you want to go y'all we ended up just paying well i ended up going ahead paying for tickets to go see erica badu so we ended up totally changing our plans but we ended up having an amazing night it was an amazing celebration for our valentine's day why is he looking at me like that anyways amazing celebration for our valentine's day yes the food was so good and yeah this is the front of the building and here goes the concert y'all thank y'all so much for watching ah!